What's going on everybody? This is Al from PlayBugGamer.com and in the last video we took on Wisconsin. They were ninth in the country loaded with talent and both teams struggled offensively. It was just a low scoring affair and the, probably the most disappointing thing was Wisconsin's offense arguably the best rushing attack in the country didn't do a whole lot against me and I kind of figured that that was going to happen uh, but we couldn't do anything on our, our side of the ball either had way too many turnovers and it led to a 12 point loss so let's see if LSU plays better than Wisconsin did today now they got even more talent than Wisconsin I mean they are just loaded with ball players and you look at their stats here the only thing they're really bad at is their rushing attack so they're going to throw the ball a little bit more so we'll see if jamarcus russell could put on a show today if he plays i don't know if he's their starter or not but i, I haven't played them in a while but i know exactly what they like to do they're a pro style offense four three defense so we'll see what happens there now let's go to recruiting we should take a hit off of that if you notice we don't have any uh up or down arrows which is actually a good thing there's no down arrows but we'll check out the handful of guys we're going after looks like one of them already uh is going somewhere else took us out of off their list it's just josh clayton this is the kid that we were going after and i guess we weren't good enough to be in his top five so tight end recruiting is going to be imperative for us in the off season we need somebody and this kid right here lawrence craig may be yet down the road but we got to wait until his sophomore year to move him because you, if you transfer or if you move a wide receiver to tight end as soon as they get here they won't translate as well hopefully we could get a natural tight end but we'll start at the very top travis moss we're still in good shape for this kid it appears we're right there with georgia let's look at uh, damien cumby i want him about as much as anybody at this point just a perfect fit for the offense back to lawrence craig i'd love to have him we're at least in his top five before, so we don't know anything about what he likes. Next up, uh, tackle Matt Graham. We're still in great shape for him. It's just low bearing in terms of the information we're getting from him. Uh, wide receiver Drew Barnes, still in great shape for him at the top of his list. No negative pitch there. Victor Dowdell, that's the name of the season. Uh, just we're in okay shape, but looks like he really wants to go to Miami. But we're going to still go after him. And that is it. So we're down to six guys. I, I need to put these points on the rest of them. Uh, let's go. Um, We can go two, 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 two. And we got three more points. We're really good with the tackle. Uh, let's go 17. Uh. 18 and 18 I, we really need some skill players we need weapons on the offensive side of the ball and come and craig really fit that mold so let's put some extra points on them okay uh esp in the magazine i'll just go straight to conference standings at the team info screen you look here craddock played a little bit better now we switched up our slider again we're back up to 40 percent and i kind of like the way he played at 40 we'll see how he does today uh, I want to go up against lesser competition to see how he does with that 40% slider. But either way, he's still playing okay. Super, I wish we could run the ball a little bit better, but as we all know, he's a little scat bag. He's just not the best when it comes to just going between the tackles and breaking tackles. Uh, Jacola is having the best season of anybody on our team. I feel like he's just playing great at tight end. I'd like to give him the ball more if possible. Uh, defensively, uh, Hofacker seems to be uh, taking away... Um, on the stat side, he's just going to be really great for us this season. We can check out LSU in the right of the very top here. Looks like early set is out for today. Matt Flynn is their quarterback. So Jamarcus Russell must have went pro. And he already has eight interceptions on the year. Wow. Just not having a good season whatsoever. But early set is their leading receiver. So that's going to help us a little bit today. Uh, Alante Highsmith doing well at tackle, long shells. Uh, okay. Again, I kind of know what to expect. They're still just got a lot of talent everywhere. So let's go ahead and take on the Tigers. 
Uh, we let's go. They're gonna go with the yellow. Let's rep. Let's do some more blue. So we'll just leave the away uniform as is. Our alternate is all white, if I'm not mistaken. I like to have the contrasting colors if possible. Really excited about this game. Uh, it's always fun to head down to the Tiger Stadium and take on LSU. Ooh, rain game. I really hope that doesn't affect fumbles today. I'll have to keep that in mind if there's like five or six. Just an awesome looking stadium. They've expanded it since. I've never been there. I'd like to go to a game there. As a Tennessee fan, I like to go to plenty of away games. Just never been down there before. Oh, yeah, that's right. They, you ha they have the uh, white uniform. That's their default home. So I'm okay with all that. They may run the ball a bit more than what I expect today. They're picking LSU as expected. We won the toss. I want the ball second half. Let's check out their roster. They're going to be loaded. So Matt Flynn is the do the uh, impact guy. We'll go after him some. Hopefully he doesn't get injured. Because I don't want Ryan Perilou coming in. He's got 85 speed. I just, I just don't want to deal with that. Uh, Keelan Williams. Let's, they got three guys that are across. The, oh, four of them. Wow. Trendon Holiday. I remember that little guy. He was really a real speedster, as you can tell, 97. Good little athlete. Charles Scott, Antonio Robinson. They just got a ton of good little running backs. I'd like to have a couple of them. Fullback, really good. Jacob Hester had an amazing career at LSU. Don't be surprised if you see him get the ball some. Early do set, but he's out today. Uh, but they're, you know, they're just got plenty of bodies at receiver. Tight end, I don't expect a whole lot from here. I don't know if just kid right here is going to do much. Uh, offensive line, 76, 94, 91, 80, and 84. So they look pretty decent at center and left guard. The defensive ends, 82 and 88. 6'5", 284 pounds. Man. Uh, defensive tackle. This guy's out for three games, so that's going to help us. But you look behind him. Glenn Dorsey was a, just an animal back in the day. They got plenty of bodies still. Uh, Ali Highs... Alon uh, maybe... I could be dead wrong. I thought his name was Alante Highsmith, but maybe it's just Ali Highsmith. Either way, this kid's really talented. 86 at middle linebacker. 84 at right outside linebacker. Pretty good corners. They have no weakness anywhere. This may be a weakness here. The free safety, Curtis Taylor. Uh, pretty good, strong safety. Average kicker, average punter. And, okay. Let's get this show on the road. They don't have an impact guy back there, so I'll just probably kick it dead on. I'd really like to see LSU's Offense do something today, like a few hundred yards at least. Uh, we can do a zone blitz out of the gate. They're doing that. I may not be able to get to him, depending on that halfback if he is blocking or not. But they're going to run. Nice running animation to get an extra few yards at nine. Well, let's do a one high. They may just run it to get the first. Halfback draw. Technically, it's a fullback draw. Ooh. Oh, he gone. Wow. Well, that was a quick one. Okay. Well, that's... I'm actually somewhat pleased with that in a sense. At least they somebody done something on their offense. So that was the easiest drive ever. That's a fullback draw of all things. But they got a, a rare fullback too. He can do a little bit of everything. And they line up for the point after. 
it honestly wouldn't hurt my feelings if they just racked up 400 plus yards. That would make me feel a whole lot better about this game if they could do that. We'll see. Matt ran it to the kicker. Go for the ball, not the kicker, you idiot. They always go for the kicker. Try to clothesline them. All right. We'll get on offense and see if we can not mess up. Maybe score, tight. Uh, let's just go right down the middle and see if something opens up. Not a bad little play. Let me make my one adjustment here. Okay, let's just run the ball for now. Today we get to see one of the most exciting defensive players in college football. Guys, they're doing every bit of that. We will go to our left. I think I got him off sides. Good little run there. Oh, he got back in just in time. Still a good play. We'll take that. Uh, let's go. Let's stay in this formation. I want to run slants. They're going man. I will probably go to my tight end. Dang it. Somebody came through pretty easily. I guess they just good blitz. Yeah. My left tackle, jump the snap. I had no chance. Yeah. Just a bad play. So we had a second and forever. We could try deep comeback to get some of those yards back. Going zone. We'll do slot protection up the middle. Let's see if I can hit this comeback. I don't I don't need to forget the post either if it's a soft cover too. It is a soft nope, it's not. Whew. Okay. They went cover three. No, they went with the they went Tampa two. Let's go back, I'll show you this. That's cool they had a cover, uh, Tampa two in this game. We'll show here what happens is, and I got the, dang it, I got my, I can't use my telestrator. I'm not going to get into why I can't. Either way, you see the two safeties, they go back, but you see this middle linebacker right here doing that. It's just, a, that's a Tampa 2 stuff right there. So that's why I didn't go to the post. Thankfully, my comeback was open. I threw it a little late because I read that one a little late, but we still got the yards we needed. So it's third and five. We can, uh, let's do tight end corner. We'll just bounce this to Suber. The clock has stopped. Bounce it to him. Probably should have stayed in bounds, but that's okay. Good little play there. Now let's see if we can do something really quick. I want to give it to my tight end if possible. Let's go curl flats. They're going zone, so we're going to go to our tight end. I will probably leave the protection as is. Good little throw there. Good little run. That same running animation. Pick up eight. Uh, let's do the curl flat from this formation. They're going zone. We'll probably go to Cannon just to be safe. The clock has stopped. Good throw there. So that's good. Craddock is making good throws. It should be a 40%. Let me just make sure that should have stayed put. And it, yeah, it is a 40. Good run there. First and 10. We can... Uh, let's go with Ace Big and try Toss. Like we're going zone. The clock is running. I'll probably go to my right just to get away from that impact guy. We can try. Nope, nope. We're going to go bring him back. I don't like that. Good defense. Just try not to get too many loss of yards. You saw this. Yeah, I had to come back. That guy just played perfect defense on the outside. Good containment. Had to cut back in. 
So we're going to have to get those yards back. Let's go. Right, let's go flanker curl. Going zone. We'll slide our protection inward. If they go a soft cover too, I may be able to hit that post, but I don't know. We'll see what happens. Dang it, I think he came back. Eh, just... Those swing routes, they're not technically the best. you got to time everything just right. I probably should have picked something else. We'll go split in drag. They're going man. Um... We'll see what happens here. I'd love to be able to... He can hear that. I may do that curl. Bad throw. Just a bad throw. That's good to see that he's not making perfect throws every time either. But I've done a, ha a smart route on that curl on the right. And he just made a bad throw. We hit the protection too, which is unfortunate. We will kick a field goal. I feel a little bit safer by kicking field goals in this game. The problem is our word. Our kicker isn't the best in the world. A 38. I don't know if he can make this, to be honest. We're going to do that. We'll do that. Ah, oh, good kick. Good job, Al. Alright, we're down four. So our offense looked halfway decent there. Craddock would have made a decent throw in that last one. We'd have been alright. Alright. Let's kick this baby off. I like to see if our defense can do a little bit better than that last drive. Uh oh, he gone. Ooh. Okay. So they ran the ball twice on the last drive. Let's just do another one high. I wish that safety would come down on the slot receiver, but he's not going to. Another draw. There we go. That's a great hole. Huge hole right there on the B gap. Thankfully, I was able to make the tackle. They seem determined to run it. Um, let's do another one high. I'm surprised I figured they'd be throwing some. Maybe that's because Doucette isn't playing. I'm not really sure. Halfback direct. Good stop there. I love it that they're using their fullback. That's pretty cool. We will... Let's do cover three since it's third and seven. I wonder if I can time this thing. Nope. Go for a screen on third and seven. Time to me. All right. We're going to force a punt. We're going to go double cross. Uh, that might have been a bad idea. We're kind of at midfield. I doubt we'll be able to return this. I probably should have just went all out block. Just don't fumble it. Okay. Uh, let's stay in ace big and let's do counter trap. We're going zone. I've been able to draw them off sides, but they get back on the line quick enough. Just my pulling guard couldn't get over there in time. He got stuck on the center. And he got stuck on the tight end, so it's just a lost cause. He couldn't get around. Otherwise, we could have had a decent game there. So now it's forcing me to throw. Uh, we can try. Wide receiver curls in a week. Uh, we're going zone here. End of the quarter. I'm kind of glad that happened. Uh, didn't really like that play. We can go back. Uh, let's go. I know a decent play. No, let's let's wait on that one. Let's go back. I can. Let's go to tight end corner again. 
They're going man, but they're going nickel. I'm going to leave that protection as he is. Just get to the outside. Great little play there. I'm trying to find ways to get him the ball outside a little bit better. That's one of them. We could pick another one. Like this one right here. Quick slants. They keep going man, so this should help us. They're going dime here. And they're double teaming that guy. That actually may benefit us. Let's see. The clock is still going. Good, that safety's on him. So we're going to have some room to run. Just don't fumble it. Good play there. He is gas, so let's pick a formation that he isn't doing anything in. Let's go. Well, let me pick another one. Strong flex. We can do this. And X dig Z whip. Going man here. The clock is going. I'd love for them to go cover zero. And they're going, they're doing that. Dang it! No! Somebody came through. Nobody blocked that guy. And I had to throw it off my back foot. It's just... Sorry. I don't even... Did I even have a safety valve? No, nobody else was open. Just a lost cause play. Just a perfect blitz. Nobody could pick him up. Oh, man, we had some good momentum going, too, but well, that went down the toilet. Uh, let's try quarters. They haven't thrown the ball yet, which is I think is really weird. Like, not once. Well, they've done the screen. That was about it. P.A. Reed. That's a catch. Wow, one-handed. One-handed. Well, let's just get back to a one high. They're going past here. Somebody got to him. That's good. I wasn't paying attention. I was focusing on what I was doing on the back end. I'm going to take a chance on a zone blitz here. If I was damn, I'd still probably run it. I'm going to see if I can get after him. Maybe I can just force a field goal. Ah. Oh, he trapped me. Perfect throw. Well, again, at least that's kind of good that they're doing their thing, but... That's good block on that halfback. Well, that's what happens when you, enter, you know, turn the ball over. They just had a perfect defensive call, and I don't nothing I could do about it. I could have thrown it away, but I would have got a 15-yard penalty. But I guess that would have been better. Yep, yeah, we're gonna get blown out. I'm afraid. I just don't think our offense is good enough. We got to play perfect offense for it to work, and we've already got a turnover, so they're with the perfection side of it. No protection there. We can try counter again. So they got 135 yards so far. Their offense is playing really good. Just nobody. Just my guard is. I I got I got to get away from that. Apparently, he just can't pull around quick enough. You go back and look at this. My pulling guard got stuck on my center, and he got stuck on the tight end again because my tight end got pushed back. So it was just a busted play. So we're going to probably go away from that for the remainder of the game. I may just have to do dives and slams. I can't even do dives. He's just not big enough to handle that. Uh, what we can do, let's run it one more time. We'll do slam for Mace Big. Going zone. It's going to be a third and long situation, I'm afraid, but... 
Good block there. That's a good little run. It's third and six, though. I'm trying to think. Um, let's go, curls. Please go, man. They're going man. That's good. If we could just get to one of the curls. That'd be good. Uh, I'm going to try to hot rat Jacola. Thankfully, he can hear that. Their linebackers are situated very strangely. Good throw there to Henry. Pick up the first. Suber is still out. We can... Um, let's run Slam with our backup. I hope he can handle this. They're going zone. I honestly don't mind if we just run the clock the rest of the way. <laughs> It'd be great if we can get a touchdown to go with it, but it's a good block there. It's not a whole lot. Uh, second and seven. We may go back. Uh, no, I need to get my halfbacks out in the flat a little bit. Let's go back to the tight end corner. That halfback swing route, I just may need to stay away from it. It's just, it's slow developing. it up field and I didn't get out of bounds uh, we can probably I'll just go back to curl flat going man again now I'm starting to think we may have a chance to score so we will try to attempt to do that right, good defense the guy was just sitting there waiting on it uh, we can try. Suber is still out. I mean, he must just be dying on the sideline. Uh, let's do... I'm going to keep doing curl flats. I'm trying to think of something really quick. We can get the ball out. Um, I'll probably leave their protection as is. Great little play there by Williams. And Suber is back. Let's do quick slants. They're going man. And they're going 5-2 of all things. So what I may do. Dang it, nope. That was a weird play. <laughs> Go back and look at this. So... He got stuck on the defender, messed it up, messed up the timing big time. Somehow I was able to get out of bounds out of all that. I don't know. Just really weird. So I'm going to run that same play, but we'll run this version of it. We've called this play several times already, but it's working for us. And they keep running man. The clock has stopped at least. We'll shift our protection. Have... Uh, Swear? That should be an easy completion. Um, we'll try deep comeback. They're going man. What I may do here? We'll do a, a smart route. There, nobody's biting on that. Ah, terrible throw. Another terrible throw. No, that was... Yeah, it was still a bad throw. My receiver had to come back for it. So, on the 20, that's a 37-yarder. We'll just... We'll kick the field goal. I probably should have used the comeback instead. I think that post route was too close. Should be a good kick. All right, we're down eight. I probably should have let that comeback stay as he is. It's kind of deep. I think we was, I don't know. Either way, we got some points out of it. Now, the question is, can we hold him off for 26 seconds? 
We'll try. Going four wide, I'm guessing they're going to try to do something through the passing game, which... Do her bump and run. He's open on the left. Get the first down there. They're calling a timeout. So the quarterback is technically playing perfect football. What I'm going to do, I'm going to take a chance here. This may be a bad idea, but I'm going to go after the quarterback. I want him to throw really quick. Hopefully that fullback doesn't stay in to protect. And he's going to. Oh, well, we got to him, though. Good deal. And they're going to call another timeout. We'll just do secondary. We'll go back to quarters. They may run it here, which doesn't make a whole lot of sense. You call a timeout, then you just decide to run it. Oh, they're going to throw. We'll stay back a little bit. Make a play, somebody. Or not. Well, now they're in field goal range. Hopefully they don't do anything stupid. Okay, they're going to call a timeout. They're going to kick a field goal. So we're going to go with defense. We'll go defensive line, I guess. We'll go special teams, and we're going to go field goal block. Maybe somebody can get through. Wow, they haven't dropped one. Oh, it was close. He got it, though. Well, so much for that field goal we had earlier. One second left. I'll just uh, get the ball and just dive somewhere, and we'll go to halftime. Like, I'd love to return this. We can try it. Just nobody. Nobody protect. Okay. Let's check out some stats. We're down 11. So... They only had four first downs, but they had the ball like maybe eight times <laughs> or eight play. They had a total of 11 plays. They have 181 yards. I mean, good for them. Their offense is doing their thing. Rushing attack is going well. Their passing game is perfect for whatever reason. It's just, it's just perfect. Um, I guess it's just because they got a lot of talent. But it's good to see that, you know, a quarterback in this game can actually perform well. So they're on pace to get well over or close to 400 yards. Uh, we was able to get to them a couple times. There, uh, we had the one turnover, but everything else has been fairly clean. It really scared me as much uh, rain we're getting. I figured we'd see a lot of fumbles, but we haven't really seen much yet, which is good. So let's just get right back into it. Maybe I can play a little bit better. Maybe I can keep it somewhat close. Maybe we can force a punt on them. There's nothing there. Let's go. Uh, no, I'm not going to do it. I was going to do another counter play, but what's the point? I mean, our guard can't pull. So let's just go here. Let's do slam from strong normal. Going man under front. Spreading out. Yeah, we can go to our right. I swear, fumble! As soon as I said something, what happens? We fumble it. <sighs> turnovers. That's that's the only thing about this game that bothers me. It's like if you get turnovers, you're going to lose. I know that sounds like pretty natural in football, but it's like I don't know. It just I hate that stupid stuff right there. There's nothing you can do about it. It's just your best running back just fumbles. Eight yard gain there. Go to a one high. The pressure turns up when in the red zone, and that's when you turn to old spice red zone. When Just dumb turnovers. Nothing you can do about them, especially those fumbles. 
Good play there. We'll do quarters at a nickel. I'd like to see them fumble once. That'd be great. Going switch. Thank the Lord he dropped that. That was a pretty decent throw. So I guess they're going to kick a field goal. Perfect kick. Now we're down 14. Can we get in the end zone today? If we don't have dumb fumbles, maybe. Our kickoff return has been abysmal so far. And it looks like it was just as bad there. I really want to get my tight end going. They're not really letting me. This is why I picked this play. Maybe he can catch it here. Probably leave the protection as he is. Just awful throw. Uh, we'll throw some more. We'll go back to our steady play of the day. Tight end corner. I'm trying to see if I can get Super going on the outside somehow. The run game isn't working. I'm not a big fan of that shift. Good that fullback or that strong safety is on him. No, the fumble! I swear! I'm about to lose it. Fumble, fumble, fumble. I gave such high praises this game then first half. We didn't see, you know, hardly any fumbles. Now we've already got two in like in three plays. Drives me insane. Well, there goes the chance of having any possibility of... Oh, thank you. Finally, something went our way. Thank you. Thank you. Now I'm afraid to give it the super. He'll just fumble it again. It's just so frustrating. I don't know what to do about it. Um, let's do X, the XZ whip again. We're going man. Finally got one offsides, but it may have been on us. Offsides. Let's take advantage of this. Let's make some plays. Somebody, anybody. Man, dime. Uh, this may not work at all. Uh, and he's being double teamed. No! Whew. I was fixing to get sacked. Had to get that off quick. They went cover zero, thankfully. Suber is still out because I think that last fumble, it just I demoralized him. I don't know. I'm trying to think. Uh, what can we do here? We have... Let's do corner sit uh, with some snag. I haven't called this in forever. I forgot that it's in here. We're going zone. This will probably go to McNair. Get a few yards. Second and eight. Super is back. We can try another quick cat throw to him. Man 4-3. This is good. Hopefully we can get something. They're going... Hmm. I may leave that as is and we'll see what happens. Terrible throw. I'm going to call this third and eight. I swear. I got to do deep comeback. And they're going man. Well, we can try the deep comeback against man. <laughs> Look how close. And of, of course, because it just, it is what it is. You go back and look at this. I almost got sacked. I, I was just staring at the line, just making sure. My, well, I don't know what my right guard's doing. Uh, it's like, 
He's staring at the guy. Should I block him or not? There we go. But that leaves this guy open right here. Thankfully, we got the ball off just in time. Just barely. So, my backup quarterback situation isn't very good. He's not even our best backup. Our best backup is the guy that we're redshirting. This guy, 84 and 82. He's just obviously not as good as Craddock. We're going to stay here. I'm just trying to think of simple throws he can make. We'll go back to this bread and butter. Unfortunately, they're going man-dime. I'd love to run in here, but I don't think they can hear it. Wide open. Wide open. I'm going to just get down. <laughs> He's going to fumble it if I let him keep going. We got to score points here, something, anything. Um, I'm afraid to run it. I really am. We'll go curl flats again. Man. Let's see if we can hit one of these curls. My tight end can't hear that. We'll leave the protection as is. Just enough. Not the best throw, but he made the catch. Okay, so we finally got a touchdown. We should get a little momentum off of that. It's going down a little bit for LSU. So, get an extra point. We'll be down a touchdown. Defensively, I, I guess I have no answers for it. I mean, they're just making their plays. I mean, they still don't have an incompletion yet. At least that, not that I remember. I, I think they got the one. I think they went on a third down and didn't convert. Let's go, Zacho. Maybe it's a tan like Zacho or something. Uh-oh. Break a tackle or two. That's fine, but man, at least you're doing something. Let's go back to a one high. They're bound, and Craddock, at least he's just out for the game. Well, that makes things a little more difficult in the pass game for us, but we'll try to keep it simple for him. Second and five. We'll do another, we'll go under front again. Nope, I don't like that. Let's go back. That's a low throw, but again, their their quarterback's playing perfect. Perfect football. Uh, we can we'll take a chance on a zone blitz. I hope they will throw it. Oh, he's six for eight. The Tigers are lining up with three receivers. They hand it off again. Pick up eight yards there. That wasn't too hard of a run for them. They had it. Look at this push. Look at their entire line right here. Everybody got put. I mean, everybody got pushed. Look at that. I mean, he could go wherever he feels like. There, that hole, that hole. He can go over here. I mean, that's just amazing blocking. Look at everybody's five yards down the field. Incredible. I'm still going to do another zone blitz. They're eventually going to throw it. Maybe I can... Uh, this may not work though. Let's do this instead. That ain't good. Ooh, good play. Good. He hit him as soon as he tried to catch it. So it's third and three. I'm going to do a fire two. It's on my mind for whatever reason. I'm going to control the middle linebacker. If I was them, I'd probably just run it. But I don't know what they will do, to be honest. They're going to throw. Oh, that's my fault. That's, I saw two guys going over the middle. I went over to the receiver. Oh, well. We'll go back to a one high. Again, I'm I'm not upset that their offense is playing well. I was kind of hoping they'd do something today, and they have been. They've lived up to my expectations so far. That's a good stop there. Williams picks up a yard on the play. 
Uh, I guess we'll go quarters. Got a nickel. Just are going four wide. Let's do this. Good defense, Al. Good defense. So it's third and nine. We'll do basic cover three. I'll try to go after him. I just can't get to him. Get to him. Impact defensive end making plays. So they're on the 38. They may just go for this. No, oh, they're going to kick a field goal from the 38. Are you dumb? Go for it. That's fine. They got a really good kicker. 55 yarder. I don't think he can kick it high enough. Wow. He lowballed it. 56 yards. They called for 56 on that one. Wow. Look how low this kick was. Again, I'm, this is another 07 thing. I don't know why they won't let him kick a little higher, but... Ah, jeez. You couldn't ask for better defense, though, and they still got a field goal out of it. So, yeah, their offense has just, just been pretty good today. This is the best offense we'll face all season. Uh, except maybe Miami's got some pretty good... Just nothing there. Miami will probably give us some fits, I'm sure. Oh, let's try. Oh, uh, we'll do counter. I have no faith in it. My tight end needs to get a push on the defensive end. Well, we're going to go to the left instead. But uh, Nothing. Absolutely nothing. We're lucky to get the two yards. Taking an eight. We'll go back to, to something simple. They have went man defense on us all day. That's the end of the quarter. We're down 10. It's respectable. I'm going to go back to Tiny. Now, there they go. Finally decided to go zone. This will be the first time I'll be able to hit Henry on this play. Just somebody came through. I saw two jump the snaps. One, two, three. Three jump the snaps. <laughs> what do you do? And I let the CPU kind of handle it the first couple of steps. Uh, just awful. Frustrating. So now it's, what, third and forever? We'll go deep comeback. I'd love to find a more spread version of that, but... We don't have the talent to do that. Awful! That was the worst throw. Oh, so bad. Went soft cover two. And look how short-armed it. He just... Where's he throwing? He's supposed to throw right here. And he throws right, right here. I mean, did I get hit as soon as I threw it? No, he was clean. This makes no sense. He's supposed to throw where that receiver, where that umpire is right there. That's where he's supposed to hit. And what happens? He throws it right... Uh, that's just all-time bad. Wow. I forgot that my backup's in here. But still, I, I mean, high schoolers can do a little bit better than that. Well, there went our chance to win the game, but I should have not have expected us to win anyways, but still. Oh, that was so bad. That's the worst throw I've ever seen a quarterback throw in this game. At least one of my own. He threw like 10 yards behind him. Like literally 10 yards behind him. I guess we'll go quarters out of nickel. And that's why he's so valuable to this football team, Kirk. He's a big-time college football player. Oh, man. Big play! Wow, I wasn't expecting that. Good little interception there. He short-armed it himself. Probably surprised we didn't get a flag there. He short-armed it. Oh, great little play, though. So we're in the middle of the field. Oh, I don't know if we can do this. We'll try to toss. I wish I had I normal in this playbook. I do more of that. Ooh, I like what I'm. Maybe I can get him off sides. Nope. 
Get a block there. Get a block there. Great run. Toss play. Looking good. That was perfect blocking across the board. That's a bad angle here. We are on the right hash. And he has already gassed. You can tell he's about to pass out. We're going man. Um, and my right tackle moved. We will just call the same play. Might as well. We're going zone. I'd love to run it. We got holes up the middle, or at least potential, but... Nope, 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 nope. So somehow my this guy got stuck, and that's why that guy almost picked it off. Just an awful play. Awful play. Taking a 15. Um, flanker curl. Or going man. Awful. My quarterback's terrible. My backup is just awful. Look how bad this throw was. Unfortunately, I have no choice but to throw. Woo! That's awful. That's bad. Third and forever. I'm probably wasting my time for doing this because I don't know. I don't think he can make the throw, but we got no choice if we want to have at least a chance of scoring. We'll go split in drag. Going man. Oh, we'll slap protect. Uh, we'll do inward. Not a bad throw. Not a bad throw. He makes a perfect throw like that, which seems harder. Yeah, he just botched that curl from earlier. Uh, whatever. Great throw, though. Good for him. So we still have him out there. Uh, Super still on the ventilator. They're going man. And he can't hear that, so we'll have to hit one of these curls if he can make it work. Awful throw! Awful! Man, that's so bad. I don't understand. Look at this. Look how bad this was. So 40% definitely makes a difference compared to 50. Look at that. Oh, that's bad. Whew, that's rough. Uh, and Super is still out. He could barely go two plays without having to see it. Going man here, I'd love them to go cover zero. I would love to go to my tight end. And they're going cover zero. Terrible throw. Ah, he had to come back for it. He's supposed to go to the right hash. So it's a one-on-one -on -one situation, and he throws it over here. Ah, that's... Oh, my goodness. Now it's third and ten. I mean, I have to throw. Uh, let's no. Let's do this. Let's just call the same play, but we're not going to go over the top any. We'll just throw it to our halfback. At least Suber's back. Simple. Th oh, you got to be kidding! Turn around. That was touchdown. He had every bit of light and day. To make a play on that one. Oh my gosh. I'm calling the same play again. We're going to go right back to him. That looked like an accurate throw. It looked like it was good enough. Free safety's on. Oh, you got to be kidding. Turn around. I don't. Is that the accuracy issue? Look at this. I don't understand it all of a sudden. Oh, that burns me alive. We're going to flip. We're going to go curl flat. I don't know what else to call. And they're going man. He, he can't hit the curl, so I don't know. I have no trust in him making this play. And he can't hear that. I, I flipped the play just so Jacola may get it. Thank you. Let's stay here. I, I mean, I'm trying to just toss it to my halfback, but it ain't happening. 
They're going zone here. This will go to Williams or Jacoa. Nope. Mm. He had a bad throw. He had to come back for it. I'm going to just stay here. We're going to go back. I'm just trying to think of ways I can get to my best players. Jacoa will get this one as long as my curl doesn't get caught up. Good throw there. Got out of bounds, too. That may have helped. Did we get out of bounds? Nope, we did not get out of bounds. I, I'm sorry that I'm calling the same three plays over and over again, but I'm just... We got to get the ball out so quick and to our playmakers. I don't know what else to do. So this play has been awful for us the last couple of times. I don't know why. Make that catch. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Finally, he turned around. Okay, so that means we're going to be down a touchdown. Is that correct? No, we're going to be down a field goal. So there's two minutes left. I'm going to have to start calling timeouts if they get a first down off their first drive. But, oh, you got to be kidding. Wow, he blocked it. Came right on through and blocked it. Interesting. Right the last millisecond, he came right on through. I'm going to go back and look at that again. Look, at this point, you would think there's no way he's going to block that. Yet, look, okay, he is literally five yards away from the ball. But he he low-balled it. He low-kicked it so badly. Wow. He's a tall dude, though. Still. It's weird. Okay. Uh, I'm not going to do an onside kick. That ain't going to help us any. I have no faith in us converting that. I think our defense is playing well enough. Maybe we can stop him on a third and out. Little trending holiday getting stopped. We're going to do a one high. You would assume they're going to run the ball. No, they're going to play action. Ah, I missed him. Dang it. Dang it, I missed him. I got to call a timeout. Well, that's not what we wanted to see. So the quarterback ended up not playing all that great in the end. Nine of 15, Ben up having a couple interceptions. Stop there. We can call timeout. I'm down to one left. Uh, defense, linebackers. We'll do another one high. Good stop there. I, that's my last time out. I feel like that I had to do that. Uh, we'll go back to a bare front. Get a stop here and we got some time. But we have to stop them, of course. They're going to throw it. Wow, game over. Oh, well, I tried. It's just perfect throw up the sideline. I was not expecting that. He went switch, and he beat him. Well, I'm sorry, fellas. I, I gave it my best. Just wasn't good enough. 134 yards receiving for that cat. I don't like the look of that. Maybe they'll fumble it. That'd be nice. I'm out of timeout, so, I mean, it's up to them to, to mess up on us, possibly. Well, losing by four to the, arguably the most talented team in the country isn't anything to sneeze at. Had too many turnovers. Bad, a bad throw, a two fumbles, two stupid fumbles. Uh-oh. Second tackle got him. Gets three yards on the play. 
we technically may have if we can stop him here we technically have some time technically nope we're not going to that's game over unfortunately they didn't get it but that's it so and they're gonna kick a field goal I mean you go right ahead but it don't make a difference now all right valiant efforts um we're gonna check some more stats and such I feel like LSU's offense didn't do squat that second half other than made a couple of plays here and there I think kicking a field goal what and of course he makes it well ended up losing by seven Wow, 250 plus yarders? It just whatever. Okay. So I may have to lower the kicking slider. I mean, he's a pretty good court kicker, but he had another 15 yards on that kick. All right, let's check out some stats and scores and see what I can learn from it, if anything. So, again, uh, this kind of worries me still. They're, they're supposed to offensively i thought that first half they were looking like gangbusters and they had less than 80 yards of offense in the second half less than 80. that's still concerning to me i thought we did pretty good offensively i was surprised especially when we had a backup quarterback in there that last quarter running the ball they just they didn't do a whole lot uh passing just again 172 yards their quarterback went 10 to 15 but he had two interceptions we used to have to get four sacks on him which surprised me they were awful on third down Again, that's my biggest worry about 07 in general. I just can't get that CPU offense to do its thing. I Maybe I have to increase sliders or something. I, I know that sounds goofy, me just losing to them, but you know what I'm saying. I want them to perform better uh, like they do in 06 at times. Uh, turnovers, that's just four turnovers, and we still only lost by seven. So you can drive that for what you will. Fumbles, just stupidity there nothing you can do about them it just happens especially in this game uh we can check the individual stuff again matt flynn 10 of 15 he was just killer in the first half and he pooped the bed in the second half just didn't do anything he even had that one big nice throw the seal it in the end the rushing attack jacob pester had that one big run and that was it but otherwise we've done a good job against their running game uh I want to go back to us. Craddock played really well. I like it at 40%. I think that's pretty realistic. 15 to 22. He had the one interception. Johnson somehow got two touchdowns. That was just towards the end, I guess, for us. We didn't run the ball well, but we haven't been able to all year. We just don't have the guy who can just you can hand the ball off to. Because you look at 5'9, 171, that's little. Uh, but we can throw it to him. As you can tell here, he caught the ball eight times, 108 yards and a touchdown. Williams had a touchdown, 68 yards. I wish Chicola would have got the ball a little bit more, but that's okay. That'll come in time. Uh, oh, yeah, one thing I wanted to see. Let's go to rushing. Broken tackle, two for Suber, one for Craddock. But if you go to LSU, see, this is another problem. It's either running ability or tackling I need to lower. Keenan Williams, their best running back, grand total of one broken tackle. There should be more than that, I, but... That's just neither here nor there. Okay, I'm tired of looking at this. Let's go to box score real quick. Again, it was a tale of two halves. We kind of stuck with them in the second half, but it just wasn't enough. But that was a pretty entertaining game. I still would like to see an LSU continue to do their thing in the second half, but they just chose not to. We'll get out of here. So at least the schedule is going to lighten up a bit. I don't know who we play next. I'm pretty sure we're heading right back into our conference schedule. We got Cincinnati. I take that back. Uh, they are coming here. A little Big East game. Our Big East team we will go up against. They are playing some football. They are 5-0. Oh, so I picked a dandy on this one. Now, they're a little bit more talented than we are, but look at their stats. They are good at everything. Passing, running the ball. It just... Look at their turnover differential. So this is going to be another tough one, but we'll see how it goes. Uh, come on back. We'll take on the Bearcats, and I'll talk to you later.